What's up, you guys? <clears throat> my name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. <clears throat> welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, <clears throat> I got a frog in my throat. Somebody doesn't want me to speak. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Captain Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, I just promoted Chiron Intuition. Um, it was a wonderful reading. Just saying, saying. I received a channeling, so I'm going to do it real quick. I hope everybody's doing well. I do. And thanks, everybody, for all the new subbies. I appreciate it. And uh, I have another channel, hashtag Leo Gang. It's hashtag, it's all one collective grouping. Hashtag, all capital, L-E-O-G-A-N-G, -E exclamation point. That's a uh, Leo channel. Um, but cross watchers are welcome uh, as well if you want to check that out. Just saying. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, don't forget the basics, time is fluid, energy is fluid, if it doesn't fall out, it fly, everyone has free will, only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest, free general collective reading. Love you guys. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, a feminine energy, um, someone is really, really, really trying to stress out a feminine energy. I heard, but through many series of chain of events, uh, it, I heard it's a masculine energy trying to stress out a feminine energy, but I heard through many series of chain of events, she's about to transmute it on him. And he's about to be stressed out. Um, that's all I heard so far. So you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody's really trying to stress out a feminine energy. But through many series of chain of events, she's about to transmute on him. And he's about to be, uh, he is about to be stressed out. So you plug it in how it resonates fem energy. Whoever you are, it's a masculine energy. He's obviously in devil energy, obviously. And he's trying to stress you out. But you are about to transmute it. So turn. The energy turn the tables around on him and stress him out um i don't know if it's something you're about to say <clears throat> i feel it might be some kind of truth or something you're about to say or do um that's about to stress him out how that resonate and applies okay for some i feel you could be a god goddesses of the moon you could be highly intuitive um highly intuitive um all well not all, all knowing but have a deep inner knowing and um uh for some i feel you could have abilities maybe supernatural abilities and you really 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 um go deep within yourself or have supernatural abilities of some shape form or fashion for some you could be psychic psychics for some you could have clear audience clairvoyance uh clear sentience psychic medium abilities or the smell ability um i forget what that's called you plug it in how it resonates. For one, you're going to let this masculine energy go. Huge liability. <clears throat> For one, you're about to report this by masculine energy, your official reporting energy. For one of you guys, you're going to let this masculine energy go. I heard he's a huge liability. So a huge liability, um, I'm, it, it might be, I'm assuming it's your company that you're letting him go of or an employment situation. Maybe your manager, boss, supervisor, CEO, and he's, do, he's doing or has done something <clears throat> horrible that slanders the company's reputation or... It's either your company's reputation or somebody else's company's reputation. Um, I feel you can be manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO of a company, or it could be your company is what I'm trying to say. Um, how that resonates, but you're in a position to hire and fire whoever you are, sir, ma'am. Uh, I'm ma'am, ma'am, you're ma'am. You're in a position to hire or fire. In this situation, it's terminate. I'm assuming it's a rightful termination. How that resonates um you are a fem energy a man and um i heard he's a huge liability so he has done something it sounds like already past energy that um um has stirred up some drama or you know is about to start up some drama or has um maybe it's like eeoc energy like discriminatory behavior or um or something of that nature um, 
I'm not sure, uh, or harassment or force or energy or something like that. I'm not sure. But for one of these masculine energies, the way you're going to transmute it on him is by terminating him. I'm assuming a rightful termination. And for one, uh, you are going to um, <clears throat> report him, official reporting energy. So whatever the official reporting energy is and however that resonates and applies, uh, I'm assuming the official reporting energy is probably um, something very serious. Um, now, you know, you can report to many different people in many different areas and avenues. There's professional reporting energy on people's licensures. If, if that is the case, I'm not saying it is, but when it is workplace situation. So it could be professional licensure reporting. It could be child protective service reporting. It could be police reporting. It, um, it could be um, any other kind of reporting. Uh, however that resonates. Uh, we've been pulling in illegal business reporting. Uh, I'm not illegal business reporting, but illegal businesses. Federal Trade Commission um, for the illegal businesses or the feds or police or what have you. Um, I didn't hear it was illegal businesses, but it could be because we've been pulling that in. But some kind of official reporting energy, whether it's like professional licensure reporting or it's Child Protective Services reporting or police reporting or um, or illegal business reporting, like Federal Trade Commission, um, that would be the person like scammers, spammers, frauds, and things of that nature. That's Federal Trade Commission for anybody doesn't know. That's feds. Um, or what have you, what have you. I, I, I'm not sure. But you are Fib Energy, and he's trying to stress you out. You are about to transmute it in a beautiful way, my dear. And one, you're going to not, uh, I'm assuming it's a not wrongful termination. And for one, you're going to officially report him to some thing, uh, some, whatever you're going to report him to. Whoa. Spirit message this year, I like it. Okay. Second chakra, Archangel Ariel, solar plexus. Let's get one more. The thinking man. Yin and Yang. That's the masculine and feminine energy here. Number 22 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 22, yin and yang. That's masculine and feminine energy. Or it could be polar opposite energy. However, that resonates and applies. I feel for some of you guys, um, this masculine ener energy you're about to report or I'm assuming, presuming, not wrongfully terminate. Y'all are completely opposites or you handle things in completely opposite situ um, um, scenarios. You do things in completely opposite ways. You handle situations in completely opposite situations or ways. Or you could ha have opposite personalities in ways you deal with things, I'm feeling. Um, I feel you guys, um, I, I, and you're highly intuitive, ma'am, whoever you are. You're highly intuitive and you, you don't want him stressing you out. He's trying to stress you out, but you don't want to be stressed out. And who the hell wants to be stressed out? And that's just the truth. Nobody. That's the truth. Um, so I feel y'all might be polar opposites. And I think you know this. Or you're about to know this. I feel you could be a goddess of the moon. I'm serious. Uh, whether you have abilities or not. I think you're highly intuitive. And I'm just being serious. I'm not saying you're a reader. Um, some people take that strictly as a reader card. No. You can be a goddess of the moon and not be a reader. And that's just the truth. <clears throat> This masculine energy has lied to you, and you know this. About to transmute it on him in huge ways. This masculine energy has lied to you, and you know this, and you're about to transmute it on him in huge ways. 
Number 36, 46, or 22 could be very significant numbers in one life. One's life, 36, 46, or 22. I heard this masculine energy has lied to you in huge ways. You're about to transmute it. Um, so, so he's already lied to you. So, well, there you go. He's already lied to you. So, um, I, I don't feel you guys get along or mesh well. And I'm just being serious. Um, for some, it could be over a contract. We have contract upright. For some, it could be over a contract, possibly. Um, or not. It could be a legal contract or not, or illegal contract, or what have you, what have you. Angel balance reverse. There's no balance here. Um, and you know this. Um, how this resonates, ma'am? He is very greedy and selfish, and you're about to transmute it on him. Professional person. He's very greedy and per, uh, greedy and selfish, and you're about to transmute it on him. Professional person. So he's very greedy and selfish, and you're about to transmute it on him, ma'am. He's a professional person. So whatever kind of profession he is in, I didn't hear specifically what profession he's in, but you are... I mean, for one, I feel you're his boss. You're a manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO of him. For one, you could be a business owner and he could work for you. For one, you could be any anything else to him. How that resonates. But he is a professional person, for sure. So I feel he has a, um, he either has a license or a certification or something of that nature is what I'm feeling. Um, possibly. But he is professional. Um, however that resonates and applies. Um, however that resonates and applies, man. Okay. For some, I do feel, obviously, you're his manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO, or you're a business owner, and he works for you. For the rest of you guys, Fem Energies, you could be anything else to him. You could be his wife, his girlfriend, his sneaky link, his third party, his, um, his, um, neighbor, his, um, uh, Community member, somebody on his ball team. I mean, anybody, anybody, okay? It is about to backfire on him in a huge way. It's about to backfire on him in a huge way. So you plug it in, how it resonates. All right, let me see if I have anything else. I'm about to take your power back. I'm about to take your power back. Holy crap, ma'am. You're about to take your power back. So you're about to transmute it on him. It's about to backfire on him in a huge way. You're about to take your power back. Well, I love strong women. You know I do, I do, I do, boo. I love it. All right, you guys. Well, we're done. I love y'all. A true leader here. And this feminine energy knows another true leader. And through many series of chain of events, she's about to help her out in a huge way. Okay, fem energy. I heard you're a true leader here, ma'am. I love true leader women energy. Y'all know that. I just do. Um, you're a true leader, ma'am. You're a true leader, uh, fem energy. You're about to take your power back from him. I think he's um, either free willingly gave it away or there was some kind of blackmail or manipulation or something. He lied to you in some shape or fashion. Um, that's for sure. But you're about, however that resonates, you're about to take your power back. That's the important part. How that plugs in. And um, you know another fem energy that's a true leader. And I heard through many series of chain of events, you're about to help her. So however you're about to help her, I'm not sure, ma'am. Only you know how you're about to help her. But he's trying to stress you out for specific strategic reasons over here. I think he's trying to throw you off your game, throw you off your kilter, make you unsure of yourself is exactly what I think. But you about to take those reins back, baby. God, I love it. All right. We're getting out of this. Love you. Namaste.